Hey, what's up guys? It's your girl Jazz, and as you can see, obviously I can't look at the camera because I'm driving. Um, please ignore this right over here because I've yet to get my car washed after parking under a tree. But that's a whole other story. <laughs> I know you're eventually going to see it, so. Um, I do plan on getting my car washed very soon, but it's too cold. Anyways, whole other story. Sorry, got ADD. Or at least I have the attention span of one. <laughs> um, as you can tell, I am driving, and we are going on another adventure. Why? Because I'm hungry, as always, because that's what I do on this channel, right? So, we're going to go try something out. Um, this is actually my second time attempting to get this. The first time I heard about it, but I haven't officially seen anything about it. And obviously, by the title of this video, you already know what I'm reviewing. So, there's no point in me trying to procrastinate on telling you what it is. <laughs> I'm going to Dunkin' Donuts! Yummy! No, I'm not getting donuts. I know. It's sad, isn't it? Um, but I might sneak one in. <laughs> because I'm driving and nobody can stop me. <laughs> but that's not the primary reason this time around. We are trying the Beyond Breakfast Sandwich. Like I said, the second time I've attempted to get it, the first time I've only seen, I went on the Beyond website and they had um, the advertised where it's in, um, I think it was in Canada. I didn't know it was in Canada, so I just figured I'd go ahead and try it. Now I'm starting to see commercial on it, so we're going to go try it out. Let's go. Yes, that's exactly what I'm here for. Awesome. Did you want to part it with the cheese and egg or without it? Uh, one with egg, one without, please. You wanted the cheese on there, though, right? Uh, yes. Alrighty. Anything else? Um, what about a drink? What should I get for drink? Let me get a, a medium iced coffee. Yes, yeah, Sam, how would you like that? Um, what are the options? <laughs> oh, okay, no worries. Okay, so we have a uh, sweet flavors and unsweet. Our Me sweet ones are caramel, French vanilla, hazelnut mocha, uh, pumpkin, white chocolate, gingerbread s'mores, and peppermint mocha. Let me do the French vanilla, please. Yes, yeah, yeah. And then we have the options of cream, plum milk, skim milk, almond milk, sugar, sweet milk, equal or slender. Let me do cream, please. Just cream, anything else? That'll be it. Alrighty, so it's very pretty now. Come on, please. Thank you. Thank you. She's so perky for being so in the morning. Oh wait, no, it's not that early in the morning. Never mind. <laughs> I didn't even have to order. They ordered for me. Alright, I'm just gonna part. Oh my gosh! Okay. Why am I so dramatic? Let's see if I can dart across this highway. Okay, it's not really a highway, but and get over there so I can do U-turns because I'm going to eat because I'm hungry. You guys don't judge my bad driving. I did, as my dad would say, I got my driver's license from a Cracker Jack box. I know, right? So I would attempt to drive and eat. I hope they put the grape jelly in there. If not, I'm going to have to buy sandwiches. Oh my gosh! This is what happens when I drive without music. Sorry, guys. Ooh, those are nice. Okay. There was nobody there when I was over there, but now that there's somebody there, I can't see on the other side. Is it a red light? Is it a red light? Can I go? Can I go? Can I go? Stupid. Oh, you're going across. So it's okay. I'm going. Yay! I made it! I didn't crash! I have a phobia of that because I had an accident doing that one time. So now I've been paranoid. All right. And this is probably why I don't like driving. Where's the closest parking spot to the gym? Yes, I'm being lazy while I'm going to the gym. Don't judge me. I already judged myself. <laughs> and this is what happens when I drive without music. I just talk to myself. I hope I can park. I don't know why I get always paranoid when I park. Alrighty then. It smells good. It smells yummy. So I got Beyond.
I don't know why I just like it. So, this is kind of confusing because I've got, so I guess this is for vegetarians because Beyond Meat is not supposed to be meat, but yet it has eggs and cheese in it. Because so I know somebody had mentioned that when I did the Beyond Meat with Taco Cabana. Um, they're like, well, is the cheese vegan? Probably not. So that's kind of counterproductive. And I'm pretty sure these muffins aren't, English muffins aren't vegan either. But it doesn't matter because I'm still going to eat it because I'm hungry. And that's part of the reason of the video. Mm. Okay. I'm not sure how I feel about it. It has a, like a spiciness to it. And I'm not talking about like heat spice, but like spices, spices, if that makes sense. I think they overspiced it a little bit. It's not bad. It's just different. So I'm, I'm going to try just the meat. So I'm going to give you a close-up of it. So it kind of gives a little bit of a meaty look to it. Smells kind of sausagey. So, it doesn't have a normal sausage taste to it, if that makes sense. But it is good. I'm also used to eating, personally eating turkey sausage more than regular like pork sausage. But, I do know what pork sausage tastes like, so I can still compare it to there. Or turkey sausage, regardless. But like I said, it's not bad. It's just a different a different taste to it. So if you're trying to eat, I mean, I hear it all the time. I would say if you're trying to eat healthier. But obviously, Beyond Meat isn't exactly the healthiest. I mean, it's still processed food. So if you're trying to avoid processed food, this probably wouldn't be the best thing to be eating. Just saying. But taste-wise, because that's obviously the reason why you're here. It's not bad, but it will get some getting used to. I normally have um, grape jelly on it, which, yeah, there's none in the bag. Boo! So, but I'm going to enjoy this. Oh, I got hash browns too. Dang, these are some big suckers. Um, Dunkin' Donut, I'm going to need y'all to um, learn how to cook, please. Ooh, those taste good. It's like seasoned fries, but seasoned hash browns. They're good. Alright, I'm going to dig through my car, see if I can find some great gel grape jelly for it, and enjoy my breakfast before I go to the gym. So make sure that you subscribe to both Jazzy Reviews as well as Jazzy Foods. Yes, I know I said my other channel first because that's what, I mean, you're already here, so subscribe to this one and then subscribe to the other one. If you've already subscribed, thank you very much. I appreciate your support. In the meantime, stay tuned and stay jazzy. Thanks for watching, guys.